I know a lot of you have these questions. Should I get a lace base? Should I get a silk base? Should I get a monofilament? What is the difference? So I am here to show you now. Okay, so today, welcome Jasmine. Jasmine has some hair loss here and she would like to know which base is good for her. Now, everyone is completely different. So what might be good for her may not be something that you want. So let's cover base number one, which is the lace base. The lace base features a lace material with individual hairs tied at the base which is an amazing choice if you would like to mimic a hairline that simulates your own. This is extremely breathable and very, very lightweight. So the pros of the lace base is the naturalness of it and the breathability, which is very important in the summer months. The cons, there are visible knots um, that are individually tied. Knots are less visible if you have a lighter color topper or if you bleach the lace on the inside, it will make the knots appear less visible. Next, we have the monofilament cap. This base has individual hairs that are tied into a mesh material that allows the light and air to pass through. Monofilament base allows you to change the part. And I put her on Jasmine's head. They're also extremely durable and have a long lifespan. This is great for people who are suffering from um, chemotherapy. It's very good for like a sensitive scalp. So the pros to the monofilament cap is its comfort. It's soft and comfortable to wear and it's great if you have a sensitive scalp due to chemotherapy or just you know scalp skin issues. It's realistic. It looks so real and provides a free and movable part. So you can basically pod her anywhere. Now for the con, not as breathable as the lace base due to the tighter weave being tied in the lace. So that's the pros and cons of the monofilament top. Now the silk base is constructed with a layer of lace and pure silk on the top part of the cap. The silk base has the most realistic scalp on the market. Silk base perfectly hides the knots which makes the part seem virtually undetectable. It looks so real. This is the inside. Now we're gonna put it on Jasmine and you will see and we will tell you the pros and cons of the silk base. Pros to the silk base is that it is really realistic. No need to camouflage the knots. The style and versatility is amazing. Like you could part this topper in any direction. So the cons. Sometimes a silk base can have difficulty laying flat. So sometimes you might need a little help with a little wig glue. You can even use um, uh, got to be glued hair gel, even eyelash glue. Perfect, put a dot there, hold it, and it will stay down all day. This can lack breathability compared to the lace and the monofilament. Silk bases are slightly warmer to wear during the summer months compared to mono and lace base. Thank you, Jasmine, you're so good.